What's up guys, uh, Tyler here, just checking in on my pull strength day. I uh, got the video edited and I'm gonna give a side-by-side -side analysis of the lifts. Um, before I was doing a little bit more of an introductory, informative, uh, but there wasn't really much personality behind it and I wanna do that um, and typing stuff out just gets a little tedious and I'd rather talk. So anyhow, um, this week I was testing um, 10, 8, 6, 4, 2. That means I did 10 reps, then eight reps, six, four, all the way down to two reps, um, increasing the weight each time. So uh, did pull day, so started off with deadlifts. Um, and as I'm going through it, um, I wanna give an analysis of how I did, or how I think I did, um, and as I'm watching the first lift, um, you know, I'm in more of a sumo stance, my legs are wider, and really just driving the weight up. During the warm up, 225 was really heavy, uh, so I did not know how the day would go, but cranked out 235 pretty easily. Um, went up to 250 next. Um, on the second one, the bar uh, swayed on me a little bit, but then I reset myself, um, got back into it, did a little pause. Um, between each rep. Sometimes with the deadlift, it's not even that the weight is so heavy, it's just that your arms can't hold it. Um, here I am now at 265 for six. Um, that felt really good. I, I almost wanted to, to do more reps, but I needed to save it for my heavier lifts. Uh, case in point, 280. Um, yeah, that, that looks heavy. <laughs> ah, got it, yes. And finally, 300, uh, going for a two rep max, and bam, getting it. One, two, fingers were so slippery on this. Um, don't use hand sanitizer before deadlifting. Oh my gosh, terrible idea. Um, I almost went for a fifth rep there and couldn't do it because my hands were just too slippery. Um, next up is the uh, cable row. Um, I didn't get my first set of 10 in there on video, but here I am doing eight. Um, not 100% sure of the weight right now. I think that was 190. Um, then I did six at 200. Um, notice how I'm trying to keep my back as straight as possible and then pulling the weight to me as opposed to letting my body rock a lot. And then finally, what I think this was 220 got it six times and just really trying to brace through my legs and you know be able to pull that um, this next thing that you'll see is uh, 135 on the deadlift uh, more of a narrow stance and then what I do are these hamstring tantrums now after doing so much weight <laughs> this is really funny to watch in past me um, but after doing so much weight I wanted to really hit my legs going as fast as possible so I keep my speed while still building strength. Uh, lat pull downs are next. I was so tired by this, guys. Like this was this was tough. Um, I I was able to do 190 for 10. I think I was supposed to do 200, but I just didn't have it in me. And then 210 for seven. I. I made the smart call. I was proud of myself for just being able to recognize, like, look, I'm tired. It's not worth it. Don't don't overdo it. And so I went down to 130 and just did as many as I could to failure. Um, and then I rested for a minute and then did it a second time. So I got 26 and then 17, uh, or 15, I'm sorry. But uh, that was the pull strength day. Uh, appreciate you guys for sticking around. Uh, these videos are way more fun for me. I hope they're fun for you, and we will see you next time. All right, guys. See ya.